Right then, I'm in some sort of barley field I reckon this is. Just left the wild area, or a crop that obviously dried up. I bet you can follow that trail all the way around to the where I gotta go into the gate. But we'll follow that we'll go on this one. Just in case. This has got to be the main one. The last stages of the walk, getting back to the church. Getting back to the church. On a hot, hot summer's day. Between half past three and four o'clock. And it really is warm. It really is. I know I've been on a walk, I'll tell you that. It's been worth it though. Now of course a few years ago this wouldn't have been a lot for me. You know. Not really, it wouldn't have been a lot. But it's enough and I'm enjoying it. Younger people would be marching, you see now, and they would find me very slow, I think. But, um... There's those cows, like a little reference point right over there, look again. Let's just zoom in on them. Right up in the corner, they've been there all for hours they've been up there. They haven't moved either, I don't know if there's a trough up there. you think they would have gone down near the bushes, wouldn't you? I was right up there earlier, and I walked all the way along, taking my time, doing photos, enjoying the scenery. I should put my hat back up again a minute. Oh, I keep forgetting about that. I took it down when I hit that shaded area. Although the peak of the sun has happened, it, it can be hot right up to seven o'clock easy. Yeah, there's a nice wood to explore, and, but that's extras. I call them extras. What we're doing at the moment is just the main stuff. Something I've wanted to do for a long time, come to Kilf. Kids go on Kilf courses. Kilf Court. I think Georgia, Daisy, all that lot have done all that. Yeah. Yes, this is also a nice walk, I think, in the colder weather. When you've got your boots and your warm clothes on. Nice little circular. So this is the first time I've been here in the summer, so I'll have to do a winter one. The Church of St Mary the Virgin is through those trees there. Just coming into view, a little bit of the tower there.
Are you bored everyone yet? Are you bored of my walks? I do try um, dedicated fans, insomniacs, the world to um, take you on different walks because I might ramble on about similar things, you know. So it might get boring after a while. I mean, quite often I put them on Facebook and YouTube for storage reasons. It's not always to keep you lot happy. And I don't, not everyone knows. Yeah, more of the church coming into view now. I'll keep this running for a minute. I'll just turn it off for a sec, actually, and get a picture from here. Wait a minute. Right then, so I've just walked down there. All these barley fields. And I came across this lovely little stream, look. You can definitely cool your feet in that, couldn't you? I'm not going to, but it's so tempting to. Very tempting indeed, but I don't want to get my shoes wet. I'll go across the little bridge. There's the church just there. St Mary the Virgin of Kilf, which is off the mile, mile down the road from the main village, you know. Ever seen the little well they put some concrete there so it's good isn't it? That leads up with that other stream where the pond is back at East Quantock's head I expect or it goes out to sea. Oh, yeah I didn't see that earlier when I came down. I sort of came down just out of the gate from the church. God, it is so beautiful, everyone, isn't it? It is so beautiful. And there's the church. We just go up to the church before walking back down through there, I think. We just go to the gate. Oh, it is so beautiful. I'm so lucky to be able to do this. I was here at least five hours ago, I reckon. I was here about five hours ago. I'd done inside already. And I had parked Alberta up there. And she could have stayed there all day. But um, the plan today is to unload a bit of my bag just get in the old Alberta for a minute and then I'm going back down down another little track to a beach because um, uh, there was another alternative route I wanted to try and then I'm going to pop it I've got to pop in to see Zara on the way back so anyway so on the right will be the church there's the place where you can get food and tea and coffee and cake and sandwiches and scones and cream and that's our church there's the old chantry the ruin which I will need to explore more oh, it could be they shut now they might shut at four o'clock oh, that's it that's a lovely picture of the church over and out. Old farmhouse that. I probably do better see selling cake, but there's a farm though. There is a farm. That's where I paid for me pay and display earlier and I parked Alberta just up there. But now, we're not far from the car. Here's the pay and display. £2.50 I don't mind for a whole day, what's that? Nothing. If it helps maintain something. Oh, that's 
people. Let's go back in the shade a minute while they're thinking what they want to do. Over and out everyone for a minute. There's the ruins.